Hi, I'm Sterling Jaquith, creator of the Catholic Mom Challenge. And this video is just meant to give you a little overview of my book and the program so you can decide if it sounds like something you might want to go through. So I have written a book called the Catholic Mom Challenge, which outlines the entire challenge. And then all of the worksheets associated with the book are free on my website. So you can go through the videos and you can fill out the worksheets. And really what this program is about is it's about improving your life. It's about getting control of everything that's going on around you. And I created it because I found that, you know, after I became a mom and I had three girls and things started getting more difficult, I would read these business books about time management or productivity. And they were really interesting, but they weren't really designed for moms and they didn't have any religious component to them. And then I would read these religious books about the importance of prayer and striving for sainthood, but they felt really impractical. Um, it didn't seem possible for me to sit in a chair and you know have 45 minutes of quiet, peaceful prayer time. And so what I wanted to do was to take the wisdom from both of these types of books and put them together in a program that I felt like moms, especially busy moms, could really use. And that's what the Catholic Mom Challenge is all about. We will visit seven facets of our life, spirituality, motherhood, marriage, rest, finances, health, and homemaking. And what's really interesting about the system is that instead of saying, you know, here's the order, here's how important they are all the time, I actually ask you to consider them as pieces of a circle. And as we go throughout our life, different things are gonna be the most important thing. So for example, um, if your daughter is in the NICU, um, your homemaking schedule is not very important. If your house is a mess and you can't even walk through your living room to get through the kitchen, I probably wouldn't sit you down and say, marriage is really important. You need a weekly date night. Um, and even though I think weekly date nights are great, um, you need to assess where you're at what's on fire and what needs to be taken care of first so that the other things can be taken care of next and taken care of well. And so that's what the system is about. We're constantly asking ourselves, you know, what's working, what's not working, and what needs to be my focus right now. And I know that feels overwhelming to you right now, maybe when you're driving and you're thinking about it all in your head, but that's why I've made the system so simple and straightforward. We're gonna write it down we're gonna jumble things around to find the right priorities, and then you're just gonna tackle one thing at a time, okay? What I'm really trying to do is to quiet the questions. Instead of spending so much time experiencing decision fatigue because you really just can't decide, you know, should you be buying healthier food? Should you be homeschooling your kids? Um, you know, should you be driving to soccer practice? It seems like it's hurting your family, but it's great for your son. Um, you know, these are the things that I want you to stop worrying about. And one of the ways we're going to do that is we're going to get in tune with Jesus because everything starts there. Everything has to start there. And then from a place of peace, we're going to assess what's going on and what needs to happen. And so I'm going to walk you through that in a series of videos and worksheets. Um, and I talk about the entire process in my book, Catholic Mom Challenge, which you can get at Amazon. Um, to print the worksheets off, you just go to catholicmomchallenge.com and they're free. You can just print them off and you don't really need to read the book. I think the book is great because I explain really the tips for how you're going to make the system successful. Uh, but if you just watch the videos and fill out the worksheets, you'll really get the majority of it. And I wanted that to be free so that everybody could access at least that. And then starting in January 2017, I'll be doing an online workshop where you can go through this process with me and with a group of women together because I think that community is so important and helping each other be accountable for our dreams is something that we really miss out on. And, you know, we live in suburban neighborhoods and yet we're lonely. We have so many friends on social media and yet so many of them are shallow and don't really help us in times of difficulty. And so that's what I'm hoping to create is community of women who love Jesus and to create a safe space where we can say, you know, I'm really struggling. I don't know what to do here. And hopefully someone else has been there and has a good tool for that, a good resource. And, you know, we can lift each other up 
and help each other fill in the gaps and focus on what's important. And the entire system, every single thing that I talk about, really boils down to one thing. And that one thing is that we are all called to be saints. We should all be striving for sainthood. And I think that's such a beautiful phrase, but every time I read that in a book before, I didn't know how to apply that to the five o'clock witching hour when my kids were crying and I didn't know what to make for dinner and I felt like I was failing at everything. And so I'm hoping to blend all of the business knowledge that I have with the spiritual practices that I've learned from reading the writings of the doctors of the church and from paying attention to the catechism, which is so beautiful, and kind of blending these two worlds together so that you can really, really strive for sainthood in your everyday life. And that's what the Catholic Mom Challenge System is all about. So I hope you join our community. We have a Facebook page. We're all over social media, hashtag Catholic Mom Challenge. And I'm looking forward to hearing about your experience and hopefully the great success that you can find with this challenge. Thank you so much and have a blessed day.